Cause how you gonna watch me now? Stupid hoe, you stupid dumb. You should have left it at the one. I wasn't the right one to fuck with ho, okay? You should have been done at the dough. You stupid hoe, stupid hoe. Nah, I'm not talking about this no more. <laughs> Mr. Berry, berry, be. <laughs> You didn't affect me. Okay? So, I'm glad that you did all this stupid, ratchet shit, ho. You tried to show and make it seem like I was all these things that I wasn't. And it's like, well, nigga. Look at yourself now. Who are you, ho? Who do you portray? What do you look like, you know? After all this is said and done, after all this shit has now been done, put out, <laughs> whatever, you know? What do you look like? Who are you, for real? Because I know <laughs> I look good. <laughs> shit I know I look good okay I know I look good and so what exactly do you look like huh again this is the end this is done okay it looks 713 H town you know I'm thankful for what where I am in life, okay, cause I'm here, ho, I'm alive, ho, okay, <laughs> bigger and better and better than ever, okay, ho, all right, look, my nigga Barry, <laughs> you didn't have me buried, okay, come on now, so it's like. What's up, my nigga? Okay, that's it. What's up? Because I think the time is now, okay? You know what's up. You know what's up. The time is now, you know? My time was last year, you know? You had your time. Now my time <laughs> is now. <laughs> and so... You know how, like, you dished out money and time and energy into putting me down, okay? Putting me down, A32, H-Town, come on now. How you put me down, or in your, in your, in your terms, put me down. You know, you have fun with that shit, huh? Have fun with it, huh? Like, y'all was really like, yeah, this shit gonna work, huh? Y'all really thought. You really, you really, you really thought, okay? It didn't work, ho, okay? And so, now, it's, it's, it's payback time. So on your end, the money, the time, the effort that you dished out before, now it's time to 9-11, dish it out back this way now, okay? Dish it back this way, it's time come back this way you know what's up I know you've been watching me you know on my T priestess shit and so you also know what the fuck is up okay look the time is now the time is now okay I deserve money payment whatever you know what's up because my life was betted on, threatened, plotted against, 
or my talent, which is my life. A- anything related to me is my life. So again, hey, my life. When you that. decided to take legal action against me, that was my life. Okay. So again, my life. And so whenever you started to plot on my life, but you really started way before then, you know when you started, okay? And so whenever you started to do that, you know, now it's time. Because God, okay? God, you know, this is real life shit. And I feel like you understand that, you know? Or you should have that understanding by now that this is real life shit. And you were doing some shit that was on some real life shit because this is what? Real life shit. And so, you know, God, God is real. (laughs) Okay, again, God is real. Okay. And so, because God is real, I know my nigga got me. Okay. And so, I'm waiting, you know, it's like tick tock, tick tock, tick tock, because it's the end of April now, okay, and you know, I'm just making that note, the date, April 30th, 2022. And so, you know, since it's April 30th, 2022, and this has been going on since about 2020, when I was, like, living in D.C. on some shit, you know, it's like, um, or maybe it started when I moved to Houston, but I feel it started when I was living in D.C. I feel like you also know that, you know, you would know, I don't fully (laughs) but I feel like you would know that okay if you don't know and haven't understood this thing is literally directed to you sir (laughs) okay look I don't give no fucks because I've been reading into things you know I'm not a lawyer you know like your brother (laughs) who represented you (laughs) okay however I um am very knowledgeable (laughs) and I can gain knowledge okay um and so you know I've done master's levels work you know I'm gonna throw this in there because you know on some shit look whatever is about to come out I don't care so on some shit you know I don't know if you know this you probably do because I feel like you've done some research or some shit I don't fucking know I don't really care however like me myself personally I walked you know across stage at Sam Houston State whenever they not at the Coliseum but that summer whenever they had the um they were using the Woodlands Church or whatever and so I walked you know I did walk I did do all of that yes however during that summer I also did not fully graduate and so ever since then you know I have been a if you want to say like your favorite rapper, <laughs> Kanye West, you know, I'm a college dropout, my nigga, you know, basically. And so even though ever since uh, 2016, I really have been trying to get back into school on so many ways, so many ways. I've like enrolled in classes. It just has not worked. I have either tried, I've paid money, <laughs> I've sent some of my AmeriCorps money to um, some schools, at least like for one class, maybe, I know for sure, once or twice. So like I really have tried, but it's just, you know, God's timing is everything. And so I know I'm gonna finish, possibly. You know, I might not be fully like (laughs) your favorite rapper, (laughs) your favorite artist, your favorite person. Kanye West, you know, on the college dropout shit, you know, because one day, because, you know, uh, my mama, you know, who's no longer here, RIP to my wonderful mother, you know, um, you know, I did start school whenever I was younger, and so, (laughs) in 2010, and so I would love to finish something that I started, 
but you know because of a whole bunch of life shit you know it's just it was hard it was very difficult and based on how uh both Kedrick and I know each other oh I said his name it's I mean okay uh Mr. Barry Kedrick you know if this is it's out there so I'm really only putting something out there that like I feel like his artist name or something is Kedrick so it really don't fucking matter what else um like it's like what else can you do <laughs> at this point sir what else can you do so I mean you can do some things you can try but I feel like my life at this point I'm not gonna say has more importance because you know we all are here and we're all are gems you know I feel like your life importance was to help me <laughs> in ways like on some shit because I mean like apparently I'm I in you may not believe that I, I'm important to you or something but in order for you to come up with all of the things that you came up with sir I have to be truly like an important person to you and whoever all of these other people who could have been involved were involved you know especially your brother you know you got your own brother involved like on some legal shit you know like his name is attached to this shit you know <laughs> so i'm just saying like you really believe that i'm an important person okay and so and to believe that you are okay not only that i'm important in whatever way but that you are also so important <laughs> over me okay hold up that you are so important over me that you could uh you know showcase that i was this up up and coming but barely knowing any fucking thing music producer um who has not learned anything basically that's what the, the the papers and what you put on paper make it seem makes it seem okay like that you, it's like like on paper uh or not in paper I guess in person or whatever like that I'm just this like I was just this person this woman who just wanted you like I was a fan and some shit like I, I came at you like oh my gosh Kedrick I love your work oh my gosh like can I learn from you oh my gosh oh my gosh oh my gosh like I just really want to be around you so much and that was not the fucking case at all my nigga like at all ooh, like ooh, no at all like what sir I had I worked for Apple ho okay like that's how I started learning music producing, teaching myself through today at Apple sessions <laughs> that I would take literally, and I'm I'm so serious. Starting with today at fucking Apple sessions on the job, or if it was on my off days or on breaks when I was at work, but on break, and I would take a today at Apple session, and I would uh, learn how to use GarageBand because I had my phone. And so I literally started, like I started on my 10R when I was working at Apple uh, around this time in 2019, ho, okay? Like, <laughs> on some shit. So I, I don't see why you would believe or try to even make it seem like I <laughs> would want to come after you like that. Like, cause the thing is, okay, so I have my, one of my, I guess, ventures that hopefully one day in the future, you know, become something or some, whatever. Um, I don't know. I'm still working on it, but we'll see. But I, I would do it. But, you know, it's something that I was working, working on at the time. And so this is why I feel like you wanted to portray it like that because, my one of my pages or whatever um staying live underground okay um which is like on some underground shit like for underground artists like not just me but like underground artists and so i was reaching out to people basically some of them uh like a couple of them went to sam houston okay <laughs> yep 
one of them also went to Sam Houston also, and I know you know who that is, okay? Uh, what's his name? He a Houston rapper. Mm-hmm. Yep. <laughs> Mr. <laughs> Just bingo, okay? And so, um, you know, reached out to some people because I was like, oh, yeah, you know, like, I can put their shit out there or whatever. It was a few people, and um, somebody else, this woman also... She also, I also reached out to her because we did a, like, Instagram live or whatever. And so after that, it was like after that. And so, because that's how we started to get to talking or whatever again, you know. And so through that, um... We were, I was just reaching out to people to like fucking put together some shit, put their stuff on the site and on the Instagram page. And that's basically it. And so that's it. That's like all I reached out to him for. <laughs> okay. I haven't thought about that in a while. And so I had to really rethink that about that just now. Okay. But that's all. Like that's literally it. And so I feel like that's why you wanted to portray it like that. Like, because I reached out to you in that way, then you could change it up in a way to make it seem like, to make it seem like I wanted you on some fan groupies type shit. Like you got fans and groupies, my nigga. Like what fans and groupies do you have? <laughs> uh, I'm some shit, some serious shit, ho, okay? But it's like, you really tried that. Like, you re you did that. And it's like, literally all out there. And you did that. Like, you set this shit up. <laughs> so that way, everything could be out there. All the shit that you did not want out there is literally out there. And so it's like, congratulations, my nigga. You got exactly what you wanted. So, ah, Mr. Barry. I hope that this has been like a wonderful journey for you, you know. It's definitely been a wonderful journey for me, you know. I'm literally gonna say wonderful because, you know, it's like I learned a whole lot about myself. I've done a whole lot. Like, do you see my discography? Okay. Do you see uh, the YouTube channels that I have created? Like, do you see? <laughs> The work that I have done, despite whatever the fuck else has happened. Do you see what I have done? Okay? And that's just it. Do you see what I have done? Okay? Sir, like, if that was the goal of trying to stop me from doing anything where I don't do what I have done, <laughs> then you have greatly... <laughs> been defeated look if you look on the <laughs> the the courtship all it is is like deny 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 <laughs> uh this is hilarious like for real though it's denied 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 like nothing but denial ho okay so i really hope that you have enjoyed <laughs> You know, you really, you brought people into shit. Look, y'all was in court lying on some shit, talking about some, a friend. Like, you really said that you don't know your friend. Your brother really said that you, Mr. Barry, <laughs> don't know your friend, okay? Okay? You said, not nah, because I feel like his name is all up in there or something, because this is court documents, so I'm a... I'm going to say names who are in the court documents. So I feel like Nick, okay? Nick will be in there because it's in there. It's public. If you buy the shit or if you look at the public shit, the shit is there, okay? Court documents. And it's like, I also looked it up where unless, like, you expunge it or something, it's not. it's also not going to go away. So I don't know if you're putting this up online and requesting it, putting it to, like, you're having your brother put it up to make it seem like, you know, to make people, if they Google me or some shit, you know, 
it'll look bad on me. But nigga, your name is attached to this shit too, ho. Like, the fuck? So if y'all keep doing that, <laughs> then you're just only going to make yourself look stupid. Again, you said you didn't want employers to like, or this is what your brother said or some shit, like that your brother, uh, you don't want employers or something. Maybe you have a job now. I don't fucking know. But that you don't want your architect, <laughs> future architect employers to uh, see basically what you be doing out here. <laughs> basically, that's that's what you did all of this for, some shit. And so basically, my nigga, you put that shit out your whole ass self. You put that shit out your whole ass self, like every fucking thing on your own with your brother's help. <laughs> Oh shit, that's hilarious. So it's like, look, I hope this shit was worth it. I really do. I really do. Okay. And you know, <laughs> look, go stream. Um, you know, all the tapes. My latest tapes are Blunt Talk Tape 9, Blunt Talk Tape 10. Okay, look, no, cuz I got to say Blunt Talk Tape 9. So blunt talk the payback okay tape nine <laughs> okay and so also blunt talk tape 10 the 420 tape and in this hoe because what we in this hoe i'm in this hoe okay look you in this hoe but you know you figuring out some shit because i know you about to be figuring out some shit look i know this shit okay Again, what I say, I'm on my tea priestess shit. <laughs> oh, shit. This is hilarious, dog. Like, you know, I just really hope it was worth it. I really do. Again. Because also, it's like, if you really did this, look, Kendrick, and I'm going to just put it out there because if you did this because of the what exactly what's been coming out in my readings and what I feel have felt for a little bit but didn't quite know but felt and then it's like no nah, I didn't I, I don't think it's that but then it's like no nah, but it can be that it might be that it, it really might be that because I'm thinking that all everybody is included in shit and you know because of the way that things are looking mm -hmm, things look and not really how they might seem in reality or whatever okay and so it's like, if you really did this shit on some shit where you like didn't want me to have certain things, be a certain person, uh, be with a certain person, <laughs> okay? Um, I'm serious on some shit with all of this right now. Like, be with a certain person. Just like whatever the fuck your obsession with <laughs> uh, <laughs> um, Kanye West is you know and who he is as a person and whatever he has taught you as, as that with all of that you know if he has influenced you so much to where <laughs> if he has influenced you so much so where you, you know, you just believe that either you can, like, try to do things that he does or some shit or whatever the fuck. I really don't understand what, why you chose to do what you did on any level with any action that you have taken, okay? I don't understand any level on any level with any action that you have taken okay and so i mean outside of you just being a very mm -hmm. young and immature person and you know not having gone through shit on some real shit in real life okay having not gone through some real shit and so and not knowing that if you put hardship onto people, what that can come back to, like coming back on you. 
like so again i'm saying like i don't know what type of influence that nigga has had on you okay but or whatever the fuck um you be going through and <laughs> whatever okay but that shit is like toxic like nigga you have me fucked up like on so many levels like it's just like like you obviously see that denied 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 like everything denied 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 like <laughs> denied 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 okay it's just denied and it's like how do you see those denials and be like okay i'm gonna keep going i mean like i understand that with like certain things you know certain things like in life like you know like me being doing what i'm doing now you know if i had stopped you know and been like no this isn't working i'm just gonna stop you know me right now in the current state that i'm in you know i can still be like that but it's like no like that's uh me denying myself or whatever but that's not something that's a an example of like some some shit where i'm like nah i should keep going but you <laughs> You want some shit where, like, nah, 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 we have to, like, like, I have to find a way to stop her, stop this shit, stop whatever she's doing, because it, like, bothers you or some shit, because of the influence that you have from this nigga, I don't fucking know, like, you would have to tell me this, I don't fucking know, nigga, I, I don't really, I don't know you, okay? So it's also like, nigga, like, how do you think that you know me when I don't know you? And you out here, <laughs> you you doing things, pretending like you know me and you don't know me. Like, if you really knew me, then you would, like, really understand me and get to know me and, like, research me to, like, really, like, fuck with me. But you didn't do that because you don't know me. You don't know how to do that. You didn't do that. You don't even listen. Like, I told you no. I told you no on some shit on some shit like multiple times a couple times and you don't even know how to listen so you know that explains a lot you don't know how to stop you know and so it's like I understand but in order for you to go on through life my nigga I think you need to fucking learn how to stop ho. because just like well but that explains again like the influence the nigga that you fuck with that nigga don't know how to stop either kanye don't know how to stop for shit okay he just keep going i mean like yes he got himself to where he's at yes again didn't stop okay same shit however certain shit he should stop like harassing people or uh being vindictive against people talking shit doing whatever the fuck he be doing that's that's bad against people that that's the shit that needs to be stopped and it needs to be stopped and that's the shit that people don't be saying shit to the people so you had people around you or something who were like egging you on you know because of whatever you made them feel about me because if you don't know me, I know these niggas don't know me. Even the niggas that went to Sam did not know me again. Like, we, I know that they went to Sam. Which, again, like, why y'all lying in court <laughs> about, like, even, like, going to Sam and, like, being, look, our, whatever, I'm not even going to go there, but in some way intertwined even if we didn't fully have full ass conversations even though we had some conversations because business to business on some shit there was some conversations so it's like look god look god be god be knowing shit okay even from years ago so it's like if you think you don't <laughs> you didn't do some shit or you didn't say some shit or some shit didn't happen look god always know okay and so I know what I know. I know God be jiggling my mind <laughs> and be like, oh yeah, okay, I remember that. Be like, why do these niggas think that they could fuck with me? And it's like, oh, okay, remembering back 
two times where we might have interacted and maybe you could have assumed a whole lot <laughs> in those times and then also based off you watching me off the internet or some shit and again assumptions that you have within yourself biases that you have within yourself and the influence <laughs> of Kanye I don't care that's a major influence on y'all and so whoever the fuck you and your people are okay um so it's like I don't fucking know but I just know that y'all you y'all have me fucked up okay and so now everything that you did is on the internet <laughs> and so it's just like is that really what you meant to do like that's really what you the route that you tried to go like that's really what you did you really wanted to do that on some shit like some real shit to make me look stupid but i feel like it really make you look stupid <laughs> i really do i really do you know you might not feel that way but i do <laughs> And so, because I feel that way, you know, that's what I'm going to believe, okay? I'm going to believe that you look stupid as shit for doing that. For doing every fucking thing you decided to do. Whenever it started, okay? Just the thought, the initial thoughts on God of having me fucked up. The initial fucked up thought that you had about me, that was it. Where you fucked up. That's that right there. If you could think back to that, <laughs> if you could think back to that very moment, go back there and think back to that. And that's where you initially had me fucked up. And then you decided to continue on with the fucked upness. And this is where you are, making your own self look stupid. <laughs> look, because I didn't have to do anything. All I had to do was show up and fuck it up. Okay? That's all I did. Show up. And fuck it up. I walked in and I fucked it up. I walked in and I fucked it up. That's it. Like, I was unrepresented the first time, you know? Walked in, didn't know shit. <laughs> like, on the, uh, the Zoom. Walked into the Zoom, didn't know shit, and was like, hey. I didn't say hey, but I was like, hello. You know, like, but, like, now I have the perspective of, like, that's, like, me walking into the fucking, <laughs> walking into a courtroom, and, like, people there, like, you know, they got a whole situation going on already with the judge <laughs> in front, and somebody talking to the judge and everything, a little bit, kind of, or they're waiting for the judge to come in or some shit, I don't know, the judge is somewhere there, because the judge was kind of there, could hear, okay, and so... <laughs> the judge is somewhere and so I'm like I'm walking in through the doors just open up the doors and be like hello and me walking in by myself and coming in sitting down and I'm like I'm here basically and then <laughs> I didn't say I'm here but basically coming in with that type of presence by myself and then <laughs> whenever the judge got on she was like um, I need lawyers. I need you to tell your clients <laughs> to not talk. <laughs> and I'm like, well, shit, I know. I am unrepresented out here, okay? Look, so I represented my whole ass self on the whole first go round. And then, you know, shout out to a fellow Sam Houston person that I helped to serve on campus with and you know do things on campus with you know especially for black people shit you know uh she helped a nigga out and sent me a lawyer info and shit and so look god okay look, you see how god worked for me <laughs> i love it and all i had to do was show the fuck up okay all I had to do was say the shit that I said, okay? All I had to do was be. <laughs> shit. All I had to do was be on some shit. And so, that's it. Be on some shit, 
Okay. So apparently, and that's on any any level because for you, apparently, my presence is a fucking problem. Okay. But see, that's why God is like, it don't matter. My presence is a blessing. Okay. My presence. <laughs> My presence, okay, is a present, my nigga, okay? So, you know, <sighs> thank you for this laughs. I really enjoy it, you know? Maybe you can't laugh, but, you know, I sure am laughing, ho. <laughs> I'm laughing like shit. <laughs> I'm laughing like shit, because this shit is hilarious, okay? And so, I'm thankful that you have given me these laughs. So thankful. So thank you, Mr. Barry. I, you know, never want to talk to you ever again, you know, but I do have a cash up that is, you know, a dollar sign T E E A L E X A N D R I A, a Venmo that is at Tecaso made that or T Alexandria um you know I have an email that you can send for Apple Pay you know um I would also like if you connected me back with <laughs> uh the big boom that initiated all of this shit, okay? And I know what you know. I know that you know what I'm talking about, okay? The boom that started all of this shit, okay? So I need you to connect me with that, okay? So I'm leaving it here. I know that you're going to listen. <laughs> In some way, shape, or form, I do, okay? You know? some way it's gonna get back to you it's going to get to you and you're going to listen and all the way through okay because not only is this entertaining okay <laughs> it's also saying how i won how <laughs> bye Yikes.